Hello, today I'm going to be demonstrating the dragon effect. Uh, please don't write in if I've pronounced that wrong, I'm sure I have. But hopefully you've gone to the website and downloaded the action set. And uh, once you've done that, you install it into Photoshop and you just decide what image you want to try this out on. And today I've picked this uh, screaming young chap. So uh, let's press the button and see what happens. I sometimes think, you know, when I do these action sets first time or on an image, you're not 100% sure what's going to happen. It's almost like being in the dark room again and sort of you're processing that print for the very first time and you're wondering if it's going to come out properly and what kind of effect you're going to get. So it's almost run its course, and uh, once it's run its course, you'll be able to uh, see this is all done in real time. So you can see exactly what I'm seeing, and that's it, that's done. So yeah, he's really screaming now. So uh, let's try uh, the Dragon Effect 2. So I'll turn that off. Go ahead. The background layer, select Dragon 2 and fire away. And uh, let's see what effect this gives us. These are all uh, actions which have been pre-programmed into Photoshop and it's telling it what, what to do. So it just saves time, even though it doesn't actually seem like it. But if you was doing this all manually, it would take a lot longer. there. Maybe I'll speak too soon. It's actually doing lots of different moves here. So uh, it's quite an in-depth uh, action set. there yet and then not quite well I definitely had time to uh, go to the loo on this one wow ah it's it's here finally it's arrived so uh, this is before and that's so it, that's before that's for the effect and this is the, the first action set I think I'll do. I think I'll dull this one back a little bit and I'll combine the two actions. Just very slightly. 25% opacity. Just, yeah. Very subtle. Yep, I like that. Too badly. Let's see. No, I, I I like that. I'm going to keep that at 100. But what I'm finding annoying up here is just uh, a little bit of hair. So I'll get rid of that. So I'm going to merge the layers, merge visibles, 
but I'll press down Alt. Oh, I missed it. I'll press down Alt at the same time, and that will give me a layer at the top. So uh, let's go in and retouch. Top. Let's, uh, I'm just using the healing brush and yep I'm happy with that that's my finish, finished image so uh, hopefully you've downloaded the action sets you use them you uh, have fun with them and uh, it'll be great to hear any feedback you have thanks for taking the time to Look at this.